Welcome to yet another video of Tracking the Changes, a series of videos that aims to help you understand what is happening in the world of marketing, what is happening in the world at large, how you can synthesize the, the two together, and what you should be doing for your business and for yourself in order to take advantage of what is going on and survive. And with that introduction, today I'm going to talk about a little bit of what we are actually seeing across the world and what you can do about it. Now, the recurrent theme across these videos has been uncertainty, dealing with it and actually coping and adapting in order to overcome the current challenges has been a recurring issue and I have already made some suggestions. And what I'm going to say here will help you understand a little bit better what you should be doing and what you should be focusing on. Let's take a massive global 60,000 feet view, so we're getting pretty high up now. And if we look at what's happened in the past, what's happening in the present, then we can pretty much see what is going to happen in the future. Bit of magic there, but let's look at it. Now the 19th century, for all that it was, was basically a time of empires. It was a time of scale. Things were growing because that's the only way that there was uh, available to us to get more resources, achieve growth, establish trade and so on and so on. And I'm drawing very, very broad strokes here. The 20th century, although it had scaling for sure, was certainly the century of efficiency. So basically we looked at uh, efficiency of scale and it was efficiency that drove everything that happened in the 20th century. And again, this is a very broad picture, but essentially that's the recurrent theme throughout the 20th century, pretty much like empire building was a recurrent theme throughout the 19th century. Which now leads us to ask the question, what is the recurrent theme in the 21st century? We're facing uncertainty at a scale that we have never seen before. We are facing ambiguity and complexity pretty much across the board in everything we look at. And we're facing challenges which we have never really expected to face before. So what is it that will actually allow us to thrive in this kind of environment? And the only thing that makes sense is resilience. So the 21st century is essentially the century of resilience. What resilience means for you as an individual, what resilience means for you as a business, is really for you to define. But essentially that's what you need to ask yourself. What is it that I need to do in order to be able to not get damaged by the things which take me by surprise, or if I get damaged, not to get damaged too much, and then have the margin available to me in order to be able, the safety margin available to me, in order to be able to adapt, overcome and survive. If you ask that question of yourself as a person and of your business as an entity, then you will slowly begin to crystallize towards um, decisions and actions which will help you develop this essential skill which is the hallmark of the 21st century. I really hope this has helped. There are more links in the description below. If you haven't subscribed before, think about doing so now. I really appreciate it. And see you next time.